What's good? What it do? You already know who it is. It's Mr. You Know TV up in this mug, mug. You heard me? Now, check this. First and foremost, I want to thank everybody for watching the videos, for liking the videos, for sharing the videos, and leaving y'all feedbacks in the comment section. And if y'all got something y'all want me to do, leave it in the comment section. Or DM it to me on Instagram at you know TV and plus follow. You heard? Now, second, I want to thank all my subscribers. I want to thank all my new subscribers. You know, I appreciate y'all. You heard? Now, check this out, man. This is these are cops, white cops that's brutally assaulting teens, man. Come on, man. Teens, like, and they 15, 14 years old. Something got to be done about this. But before I get into that, before I get into that, you know I got to run this up, right? You know? I ride around with the pistol on the side. I blow it down with the power to the sky. You, you we know? Do, you niggas got to have what it do. Homicide. Spitting stupid reckless thoughts got me feeling hectic That's life for your ass, grow up fast Learn the ways in these streets, and he's always lurking Devil's out, we so searching Yes sir, and I'm back like cook ah You heard? Now check this out, man. This is crazy, man. We we def gotta get into this. You know what I mean? Hold on, let me, let me fix my camera right, cause my camera ain't looking that right. You know what I mean? I gotta have my joy looking, looking proper, looking proper. You know what I mean? Looking proper. I, right. I guess that that was my. I don't know voice proper. Looking proper. <laughs> Alright, yo, let's let's get into this, man, cause yo, this is wild. You know what I mean? Like, come on, man. Yo, these 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 police officers be going too far. Like, they go too far with it, man. You know what I mean? They need to be stopped. But since they police officers, most of them get away with it. You know what I mean? Let's get into this, man. If you can't tell, they're all coming. <laughs> Stay over there. He too, he too tough already, that police officer. When anybody else gets here, they all need to go. He's a 15. They all need to go? They all need to go. He's a 15. Look, he demanded, right. he demanded everybody. Hey, Ronnie. We're going to be outside. Uh, 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 you hear all the police calls in the background? The hell? <laughs> Whoo! Excuse me. Oh, y'all seen that? Y'all seen that? Oh, what the f Yo, he what straight grabbed homie that? by the did neck. You know what he did? But did you and first off, homie only 15. He allowed a phone call. He was supposed to have a parent or guardian there. They're not supposed to touch him or do anything without the parent there. That's crazy. See what he did? Hey. hey. Bro, hey, what? Hey, what's your password, fam? What's your password? Wow, bro. Those are Broward County, Florida police officers. That's crazy. And the kid they just slammed face first into the ground is only 15 years old. And as you might have noticed, Sad, that kid wasn't doing anything wrong. But that didn't stop this officer from grabbing him by the neck and throwing him to the ground, all for trying to make a phone call. But the situation exactly. isn't so simple for the officer who just used excessive force against a child. Because in the state of Florida, any minor detained by police is allowed to call their parent or guardian. Exactly. They're not supposed to do that. You know what I mean? They're not supposed to do that, man. These cops be, they, they be, they be abusing their authority, man. And have that adult present at any proceedings. What the cop did isn't just an excessive force violation. 
it's also a clear violation of Florida's juvenile safety procedure. But then the situation falls apart even more when the same officer refuses to provide his badge number. Of course. Another clear violation of Florida State Police procedure. And of keep an eye on how his supporting officers up. stand by him, even as he's breaking the law. I got you on camera, bro. You're, you're, what's your badge number? What's your badge? What's his badge number? What's his crazy, badge number? What's your badge number? What's your badge number? What's your name? What's your name? What's your badge number? What's your badge number? What's your name? What's your name? Okay, but what's your name? Okay, what's his? See. The female cop, she knows, she know that that cop's in the wrong, you know what I mean? She knows that that cop's in the wrong. This dude, he know he in the wrong too, but you know what I mean? I guess that, uh, the other cop that assaulted a little kid is, uh, I don't know, man. I, he got something over him or something, or he a bully, straight up. Badge number. What's his badge number? What's your badge number? What's your name? That's crazy. Look, he ain't trying to give nothing up, your badge bro. Number and your name. No, I need his right now. I need his right now. What's your badge number and what's your name? He ain't trying to give it up. Okay, I am. Corny. It's pretty clear what's going Corny. on here. This officer realizes he just screwed up. Yeah, he screwed up. He know he screwed up. This entire situation never happened. And then a second supporting officer attempts to end the recording with a little tried and true intimidation. Watch this. I Man, I know you're recording me, but I don't care. Nah, you, that's none of your problem. You, you guys are obligated to tell me. You guys are obligated to tell me. You don't have to address me. I don't need to speak to you. Exactly. I, I want his badge number and his name. No, you don't, yo, yo, don't touch me. Don't touch me. See, they doing the most right now. They doing the most right now, man. I mean, he ain't supposed to be doing that. You trying to, which you don't want him to, him to film it. Because you know that once they get out, it's going to get out. And it's going to go viral and everybody going to see it. Don't touch me, bro. But don't touch me then. Don't touch me then. The I pay to be here. Keep in mind that the entire time this it's guy crazy. is trying to get badge numbers from these officers, they're waiting on reinforcements to forcibly remove him and other witnesses from the scene. Of course. They want to be left alone with this minor who they've just denied the right to call his parents. And it's not hard to imagine why. And as this TikTok user... That's because they don't want nobody to see what they're going to do or interrogate him. You know what I mean? They don't want nobody to see or hear that. So, of course, he's waiting for the other cops to come to push everybody else way farther away so they won't see what they're doing or hear what they're saying to him. You know what I mean? He's a juvenile. Come on. Come on, man found out, the officer involved in this incident has something of a history with letting his violence get out of control. I oh, bet. This is my daughter. Put that down. This is my daughter. She's I 14. You that. can't arrest a 14 year old. No, you cannot. In a little Lincoln, girl. Colorado, police just went hands on with that man's 14 year old daughter. No, you can't. Bullshit. A little girl, 14. Let me get my you are not uh, going is trying to restrain the family's Jack Russell Terrier. Gonna walk He's over gonna fart. The poor dog is like, what the heck are y'all doing to her? What are y'all doing to her? That's my sister. Who are you doing to my sister? Ruff, ruff, ruff. Fighting everybody. Let me get on the ground. Let me get on the ground. He worried, about, he worried about the dog. The police officers worried about him getting on the ground. He trying to get his dog to safety. You know what I mean? Like, come on, man. Doing the most. I'm not resisting, he said. And yet, I'm not. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Stay down. Don't move. You stay down. And look at the dog. The dog is like, yo, what are you doing to my owners? What are you doing to my owners? Come on, man. Look at the poor dogs. Like, no, don't move. Uh, crazy. If you get up, you are going to get tased again. Do you understand me? Dog, you stay down. getting my dog. Roll over onto your stomach. I was getting Put your dog. hands behind your back. God. Put your hands behind your back. God. Do not move. Corny, yo. They corny for that. The police officer corny for that. Scott. Look at that. Look at what he's doing to the room. Put my dog away, please. We will take care of your dog. Put your. Please, I don't want you guys to shoot him. We're not gonna shoot your dog. God not at all. 
seconds later, one officer lifted the dog by a leash around its neck. Stop. What? Hold on. You see how he lifted the dog up? Look at this. Let me move on this. Away, we will take care of your dog. Put your... Please, I don't want you Watch how he lift the dog up, yo. Shoot your dog. God damn. Seconds later, one officer lifted the dog by a leash around its neck. Stop. 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 I'm not choking. Yes. I'm a canine officer, dude. If you're a canine officer, you should know how to handle a dog. You know what I mean? You should know how to handle a dog. That's animal cruelty right there. Animal cruelty, and the police officer got it on his his cam. He being cruelty to animals, and you're a canine officer? But you straight yoked this dog up by the neck. Poor dog choking, dangling on it. You know what I mean? Like, come on, man. Jeez Louise. Look, he still got the dog by the neck. Can you get your feet out of the way? Can you get Look your feet out of the way? Wow, yo. Good boys. Good boys. The guy just tossed the dog. Get back. No wonder why you guys get down there. Exactly. Crazy. He damn sure did. You are under arrest. Obstructing and resisting arrest. I stuck nothing. I was trying to help you. The level and come. Yo, man, these cops get away with way too much, man. Way too much. I want to swear right now, but you know what I mean? I'm toning down the swearing, you know what I mean? So, but them cops is doing the most and they're doing way too much and they are out of order. Definitely out of order. Colorado police are now being sued. Hello, everybody. Of I'm course, I bet. Officer they need us. to be sued this case and fired. On June 22nd, 2020, when police responded to an incident at a nearby Safeway grocery store. Crazy. John Sears had a 14 year old daughter we are naming SS. SS believed her 18 year old boyfriend had cheated on her. After yelling at him about it in the Safeway parking lot, she slapped him. Then, she rode away on her bicycle in tears. Somebody called police. Of course she hurt because homie cheating on her. 18, you messing with a 14-year-old? Come on, man. something wrong with that. You should at least have your girl should be like 17, son. You know what I mean? You messing with a little 14-year-old? Man, it's crazy. And they sent multiple officers in response. She's standing here and yelling at me. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Snitching to the cops, yo. About how I'm a piece of shit, how I'm cheating on her, how I cheated on her, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, I'm not even with her and I'm not with you, so it's not cheating, you know? It's like he got a bunch of hair on one side and this side's like mad flingy. Like, what the hell, dude? Get a new hairdo, man. Put that joint in the bony tail or something. Well, is this something that... He said he did not want to press charges. They go through a, a packet and fill out all your information and give a statement. And yeah, you, if they went that far, you would have to do that. He don't want to press charges. Still, the police decided to arrest SS and charge her with assault anyway. Head to that address. Yeah, see, they got it out for them, man. These the, these them, these them cops that, you know what I mean? Nah, man, nah. They went to her house. She was not home. They spent the day hunting for her, banging on the windows really? and door. A 14-year-old girl, they hunting for her all day because she slapped her 18-year-old boyfriend in the face, rolled off crying in tears because he cheating. Come on, man. And they searching for her all day. Numerous of times going back and forth to the house and shit. I'm pretty sure they was outside, staked out, waiting for her to roll up on her little pink bike. Members of her parents' home. We're gonna try a couple more times. Hours later, they returned again. And this time, they found SS's dad outside working on a bicycle. They asked him to call SS out of the house, 
The police said they just needed to talk to her. That is a bunch of crock. Because we seen it earlier. They had her hemmed up, ready to arrest her. You keep going back and forth to the house to see if she there. Clearly, y'all want to arrest her. You know what I mean? Trying to get arrested in for the day. Corny. Please. They did not mention that they were there to arrest and jail his daughter. That's crazy, yo. Look at the dogs chilling, man. They having a good time. Father fixing a bite. She probably called a flat because she was crying. Exactly. So you want to go arrest it? See, she want all kids stuff. Like, it's kid stuff. She want an elephant, her bike key. Like, really? She can't even wipe well. You know what I mean? She still got poo-poo stains in, in her panties, man. She only 14. But he should be one getting arrested because he's 18 dealing with a little 14-year-old like, do y'all not see that? Really? This is crazy. And my dad's bike, uh, or my dad's, dad was called bungee cord. And I didn't get the bungee cord back. I didn't get my elephant back. These cops ain't ish, man. He said he would pay for it. And he told me to pull the money out of my ass, and then I walked away. And then I came back home, and then I was like, okay, I looked at the lanyard to make sure he didn't leave anything on it to make sure he gave me everything. What are they saying? Then the police muted their body cameras. Exactly. When hold on, hold on. What was they saying? Let me rewind that back. What was they saying? My bike lock key. And my dad's bike. Uh, or my dad's. Dad was called bungee cord. And I didn't get the bungee cord back. I didn't get my elephant back. I went over there once for the bungee cord. He said he would pay for it. And he told me to pull the money out of my ass, and then I walked away, and then I came back home, and then mm. I was like, okay, I looked at the lanyard to make sure. They know she young, man. Look, that's why they mute when they um, joint. They body king. Then the police muted their body cameras. Of course, man. When she admitted to the slap, they put their hands on her to immediately handcuff and arrest her. Grimy. As her dad starts to react, the camera audio goes back on. Of course. Stop. Stop. No, this is my daughter. Put that down. This is my daughter. She's 14. You that. can't arrest a 14 year old. No, you cannot. No, you can't. Let me get my daughter. Let me get my Actually, she can get arrested. But come on, it's a 14 year old that slapped her 18 year old boyfriend. Which is an adult. And she's getting arrested. And she's getting arrested. It's crazy, yo. It's crazy. You are not going to walk He's over. He's going to start fighting everybody. Look how you grabbing, dude. Get on, get on. For trying to get the door. Get on the ground. Look, he's just pushing the mission. Get on the ground. Wow. On the ground. Look at, the, look, at look at the poor dog, man. Look at the poor dog, man. If you get up, man. you are going to get tased again. Do you understand me? You stay down. my dog. Exactly. Over your stomach. I was getting Put your hand behind your back. He didn't even have to tase him because he wasn't even resisting arrest, man. He's just trying to get the dog. And wonder why y'all arrested my 14-year-old daughter. These cops ain't ish. They ain't ish, man. Abuse their authority. That's all they do. Put your hands behind your back. 
Do not move! I won't, sir. I won't. I won't move. It's crazy. Look, he down there, him and the daughter. The other cop down there, him and the daughter. Put my dog away, please. We'll take care of your dog. Put your... Please, I don't want you guys to shoot him. We're not going to shoot your dog. God. But 11 months earlier, Loveland police did shoot a woman's dog. Mm. This is my baby. Mm. These cops are out of control. These cops are out of control. Seriously? And you know what, man? It be, it be the cops, you know what I mean, that always get picked on in school. They want to be a cop, so they feel like, you know what I mean, they got something over you. They, they feel like bullies now because they cops. But back in high school, you was getting whipped out in the yard. You was getting picked on in class. You was walking down the halls with your head down. Now you talk flight security because you're a police officer? No. No. And that's exactly how these cops be, man. But I ain't even going to front, man. It be, there's some good cops out there. There are some good cops. There are some nice cops that actually care about the community and care what goes on with the people. You know what I mean? Not no assholes. There are good cops out there. And then you run into these type. You know what I mean? Pieces of ish. It's crazy, yo. It's crazy, yo. But y'all already know it's about that time for me to slide on up out of here. You know what I mean? Leave y'all feedback in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about this. You know what I mean? I want to hear what y'all got to say, man. I want to hear what y'all think about this, man. And as I said, man, if y'all got something y'all want me to do, DM it to me on Instagram at you know TV, and also follow the Instagram page. And follow my second page, you know TV 2.0 on YouTube. You heard? You know what I mean? Like and share, man. I appreciate y'all. You heard? You already know. It's Mr. You Know TV. Ow.